Oh, we can have a pool in the house underground. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to The Sims 4 Pals. Today, we are going to be creating a secret dungeon under the house. That's right. We have a large house, so I think we need a large house. Dungeon because somebody asked me why don't you make a room under the stairs and I was like hmm We could do that or we could have a room down Under the stairs mm, you see okay, so how we're gonna do that is build mode obviously Now I haven't built a basement before in the sim So I don't know how I'm going to do it first up. I'm going to move the chessboard and table uh, over here There we go. I was about to click and drag Frank to you can't do that. But anyway, let's see how we build a base mount. Ah, hello. We have an underground. But how do we know what is above it exactly? Uh, how do we, do I have to look straight down? Maybe. Okay, here we go. So we're gonna go down. And I think, you know what? We'll just build a big old, that's not what I wanted. Um, I've just built a large wall there. Sure, we'll, we'll carry the wall on. We'll make it a normal room. There we go. Lovely stuff. Cool. So we have a basement now. Stairs, however. I think we choose these ones. And then if we get... Oh, some dark stairs. Can we put them down like this? Is that... Oh, no, it doesn't like that. Oh, they disappeared. Why are they so large? I don't know. Can we spin it around? Um, is this right? Let's look up and have a look. Oh, it is! Okay, so if we make them three wide, like that, cool. This is awesome. Right, so we now have some stairs into the basement. Let's go back down, and we can work on the area we have. So I'm actually going to make this room a bit smaller, and then we're going to drag it forwards a lot. You know what, why not all the way to the end? There we go. Cool. So, our spooky basement. Do we want to make it all spooky or cobwebs and like vampire stuff? Maybe we could have a vampire friend in the bottom of the house. Maybe. We'll see what happens. So, carpets. I want to get a nice... Oh, I like that. Yeah, we'll get a nice dark spooky floor. Lights are important, of course. Otherwise, you won't be able to see down here. So what type do we want? We need something, something that fits in with the theme well. Like this one. It's not big enough. Something... Oh! Victorian chandelier. Ooh, ooh. <gasps> Large vaulted Victorian chandelier. Wow. Can we go down again? Oh, we can. Okay, we can only go down two floors, though. Uh, so what do we do? I kind of want to... I want to have this room lower, but I don't know if you can do that. Oh, you can! Yes, please. All right. We'll be doing that then. Let's click back on this. Assuming it broke. It didn't. It was already there. Cool. Back to the lights. And I'm going to get the cool chandelier that we had. Just then. Oh, festive wall light. Yes, Merry Cri Christmas basement. No, there we go. We'll get this cool one. I think that was the right thing. Yes, it was. All right, so I'll have one over here. Maybe we'll just have one in the middle like that. Ooh, this is cool. I like what we're doing here. If you have any suggestions for other things you want to see in the house or the Sim series, let me know in the comments below. And of course, don't forget to subscribe for more fun. Cool, so we have one of these. What does this one look like? You know what? That's perfect. We will place two of them. One here and one in the equal side. Like that, I think looks correct. Yep, sure does. And then again, I'll do the same here and... Yeah. I think I've put that one in the wrong place. I have. It's gone. And now it will be back. Where does it go? One and a half in, so... Ha, one... one. Two. What? One, two, and a half. Boop. There we go. I did it. Congratulations, me. But now I want to move this one because um, it's a bit off center now, isn't it? There we go. Cool. What do we want down here, though? I'm not too sure. Can we get any windows underground? Do they let us do that? No, but we can have. Cur oh no, hang on. Is that right? No, this one. There we go. What happens if we... Of course, footprint intersects terrain. Obviously, the footprint, it intersects the terrain. Okay, so no windows for us, even like skylights. A pool? There's no way we can have a pool in here, can we? 
Oh, we can have a pool in the house underground. That's that's really deep. That's quite scary. Don't like that. Maybe we'll have a pool as well. You know what? We have a lot of space to work with. This is going to be crazy. All right. I want to put up some nice wallpaper. We need something to match the spooky theme. Purple. Yeah. I like that. The first thing I saw, I was happy with. They have a bunch of other colors too. But I think the purple works nicely. So, rugs. Where do we get rugs from, hey? Do we have to go to the living room one? And then, yes, we do. I've gone very Australian now. I don't know why. I apologize for that. Oh, nom de plume, antique rug. I like that. But I want something else, something more spooky. Magic carpet. Maybe not. Maybe not a magic carpet. Bit too, bit too much. Oh, Princess Cordelia rug. Oh. Oh, don't mind if I do. Alright, actually, I mind if I don't. I'm not gonna. <laughs> what is this? No sweat, no fuss rug. Peculiar. Oh, it's like a like a yo big yoga mat. You know what? We'll go for this one. We'll have it right there at the bottom of the stairs. Does that look any good? I don't know. Oh, I have a cool idea. I'm just getting idea after idea. So you'll have to bear with me here whilst we're having our building extravaganza. Now, I want a fancy sort of round table. Do they have any fancy round tables? I'm not sure if they do. They don't exactly have the thing I'm looking for here. Maybe this might work? Oh, actually, that's pretty good. We get a different color of top, black and gray. Yeah? Nah, I want a different color. I want the red one that we had originally. There we go, cool. So I want, I want it to look like there's something spooky on the table. So we need some spooky decorations. Where do we get spooky decorations from? A little cat statue on the table. Kind of looks like Sir Meow's lot, but we can't put it on the table. Uh, oh no. I don't want you if you can't be on the table. Aha, you are what I'm looking for. You little thing hiding in the dining room table section. No, no, no. You're not what I want. I wanted something like you. Where am I looking? for a decoration, something spooky. Do we have any, Oh, That is perfect. That is exactly what I'm looking for. Check that out. Yeah, that is incredible spook. I wanna bring someone down here, like a, a neighbor and have them be like, uh, this is creepy. Don't like it very much, it's scary. Locks chest, locks it, oh. It's too high for the room. Oh no, it's not. <laughs> it's just too high for the lamps. What about this one? This is crazy. Where are you gonna put these things? Where do these go? Who has room for this in their Sims house? A wooden hospital cabinet? Wooden hospital? Oh, for the hospital. Of course, the career. Nothing else is really as spooky as this thing. Is this just all we want in the basement? Just, just that, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. I'm really stuck. Maybe we can have some cool organ. That vampire had a giant organ in his place, didn't he? Those are sound systems. Where would one find an or Oh, a bust? Oh, here we go. Creepy statues. Hmm. Anything good? Little tiny train set. No, nothing particularly good. There's a lot of gnomes. I don't need any gnomes. But if I if we do end up having a gnome. Then great. Chiseled floor or pedestal. Maybe that would be cooler in the middle. But I like this tiny table. Animal directioning. Meow. Well, that'd be weird to go downstairs and you see someone. No pooping. I should have put that upstairs. And maybe Galaxy would have stopped pooping everywhere. Right. I know what I'm looking for now. We want the this one. Oh, no. You can't. Where is it? Okay. Hang on. Organ. Napoli Palo organ. Is this what I'm looking for? No, aha, yes it is. We want it dark though. Yeah, we want it black, black, yes, perfect. <laughs> that is looking great. That is exactly what I'm about. Ooh, do they have a bigger one? No, I thought the other guy had a bigger one than that. Apparently not though. That is what we are all about here in the basement of the house. I think it's bad, uh, pretty good, yeah, pretty good. I was gonna say bad then, that's not the word I was looking for. Hanging werewolf wall jumper. My gosh, that is absolutely horrifying. Why would you want that? 
Ooh, this is perfect. I was looking for something small to go above the organ, and that is exactly the type of thing I was looking for. So, great stuff. Carolyn Hubert. Bit weird. Uh, but okay. Spy satellite. Oh, wow. All right. So we've got this looking pretty spooky so far. There's not much. It's pretty bare. I'm spending a lot of time just looking through the menus, hither and hither. But we should look for maybe spooky couches for the people who come down to sit on. Uh, not a bench, exactly. We want, oh, a gothic love seat. Ooh, black chaise long. Thrill of the chaise. What a funny pun, hey? Maybe the spooky one is the kind of thing we're looking for. So if we put one of them here, we'll get another one, and we'll... I keep pressing R to rotate. It's not R. It's a full stop, period, which is not the best thing. Good. Table of the coffee variety. Something, something spookier, please. Do you not have anything spooky? Maybe this? Yeah, there we go. And a new rug to go next to this rug. Oh no! More yawns. This is apparently a spooky rug. Doesn't look very spooky, does it? Like a, That's quite ugly. I don't like that. Anything else from the spookiness? No. Oh yeah, here we go. Oh. <gasps> Oh, there we are. I like that. That's quite nice. Cool. Gonna move the chairs in. Tad. There we go. Nice. It's coming together pretty well, I think. Maybe the floor needs to change, though. The floor, the wood material. I don't know if it's the best thing. Maybe it is. Maybe it isn't, though. This is apparently spooky as well. Doesn't really look much spooky. Red. Nah. Black. Grey. Too bright. Red version of this? That version? It's the same one. White? I don't think that's too great. I'll, I'll just stick with what we have, actually, you know? Or we could have a quick click through these ones. Carpets, purple. Oh, that's that's a lot of stuff happening in my eyes. Spooky tile. That's, again, a lot of stuff happening. There's, nothing's too, like, simple. Stone. Oh! Oh, we can color it as well. Gray stone. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I want. Let's turn to... This looks fantastic! Check it out! I'm loving this. Alright, so, how do uh, people get in here? They can't yet, because we don't have a door. So let's make a nice spooky door right under the bottom of the stairs. Door? Do we have anything... Oh, yes! Please tell me... Why can't we have the... We can't... What? Well, oh, because there's a light in the way. Great. That's annoying. Is there a double-sized spooky door? This one? Yes? No! No, that's not what I want. There's not a single size spooky door. There is a hidden bookcase, but we can't get it because... Oh, no. Oh, a soulful entrance. Can we have that? Yes. It's too big! What about the rainbow door in, in this color? <laughs> yeah? Is that what we're looking for? Is that the type of thing we want? It's absolutely not. Maybe we'll just have a kind of dark nondescript door let's put the walls up see what it looks like yeah doesn't really look like much does it but alas once you open it and head inside you go underground right who is home to go and experience this Coral's on the couch scoop is somehow already there that's peculiar well sketch down you go let's follow him shall we let's track him on the camera and watch you go down. he's just done a stinky oh no he is stinky here he comes into the dark dungeon. <laughs> He's just heading into the void. There's nothing down here apart from this basement. Wow. Welcome. Do you want a seat? Can I have a seat? Since you're tired, you can have a nap down here too. This is really, really quite strange to look at. The fact that it's just a flat thing with some couches and an organ. Just, just in darkness. Eternal darkness. Welcome, Sketch, to the secret dungeon where you are trapped forever! Alright, he's leaving. He's had enough. Cool. Well, you know what? I'm pretty happy with our, uh, our work done here today, everybody. So, even though I didn't really do much stuff on it, let me know what you want to see in the basement. Other things, we could add the pool, you know, we could have some spooky bedrooms. Maybe a bit more decorations, if I can find any, or... A vampire to live with the pals. Oh, Sketch is even more uncomfortable now. But yes, if you enjoyed this, make sure you hit the subscribe button. I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.